Hello everybody and welcome back to more Decked Out 2. We are back again for another four runs. I did actually ask on the Discord for the little weird bug I had with getting two things at once. People said it was fine. Uh, well, Alexa, at least he sort of brought it all together, said it was okay. Um, and especially considering I don't know what the hell I'm doing. It's not really that much of an advantage to me anyways. We're going to jump in again for a few more runs today and see what we can get done. I think last episode we did pretty well. We, we didn't do too bad. Uh, and now we can start buying terms, which is actually what we need for victory. I think we are going to up the difficulty to medium at this point just to see how it goes, but I am willing to lower it back down again if things don't go too hot. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say right now, because I have a feeling that medium might be quite the jump in difficulty for us. Let's press that. We'll come over here and press that, make sure these two are randomized, and uh, and see. So we did get our uh, relic here, so let's do this. We got the pearl here. Apparently, um, is ready for its next I don't think I would... I don't think I meant to set this as my spawn, am I? Oops. Is that a bad thing? Am I... Sleep in the bed, remove all your gear. Okay, that's fine. Uh, right, okay. Um, we can put that in there. And we can open up our crate and put our new card in that we acquired. Loot and scoot. It just sounds great. It sounds really good. We we'll hope we can do some good stuff with that. But yeah, let's pop that in there. And I don't exactly know when we want to start going for um, for terms. Because like I said, we need those for victory. But realistically, we probably want to spend a few episodes building ourselves up to get more powerful and then go for them, but I don't know if that's going to be the right way to go about it. I honestly don't. I I need to see if I end up getting any medium adventures here and see how they go. Um, going like going down to level 2 could make things a lot harder. Uh, we'll need to grab a key for 1. Um, we'll see what we get here. So this is a level 1 artifact still, so no level 2 just yet. And we've still got level 1 here. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm curious. I'm curious about doing a level 2 because that could be quite quite worrisome, but we'll try our best to get what we can here. Um, wow. Spawn Ravager. That is not fun. That is not fun at all. He's in front of our berries, the bastard. It's not what we want to see. Okay, he's still all the way over there, so we're safe around here. Can have a little look around for some loot here and there. Might have to wait a little bit for stuff to drop, but we can take a little peek a around. There's a chest down there. There's some fish, but I don't know if that chest has anything in it. And in my test run, I went down there and I drowned, so <laughs> I'm a bit scared of it, to be honest. Stability. Okay, a berry bush is over there. Is that still not... I, I don't know if it's that they don't regrow, or if it's genuinely that... Because like, I've reset the game since then, or if it's genuinely that sometimes they're not... They don't have berries on them or something. I don't know exactly how that works. Maybe to like randomize it a little bit. That's like kind of on purpose. Okay, so so far I'm not seeing the key. I've not really been looking for my artifact yet, I'll be honest. Um, I've kind of been just looking for the key. Which I don't actually need right now, so I should be I should stop looking for the key. Thank you, some berries. Oh, hello. We've... Uh, We met, we're we actually pretty close to the artifact here. Hopefully that... Oh, fuck's sake. I was just about to say, hopefully there isn't a Ravager in this room. When there's a Ravager in that room, it makes everything ten times more difficult. Let's head back over this way. Yeah, it makes everything a pain. I mean, where's our other Ravager around here? It might be okay to go through here. I'm just going to check this corner because coins often spawn there, but unfortunately nothing thus far. No Ravager in this room, which is kind of rare. No Ravager in there either. Just quickly seeing if I can see any uh, loot about. Basically, I just want to kind of have a little peek into each area, see if there's a Ravager nearby. Some more berries there. There's some soul essence stuff there, thank you. It's only one, but it'll it'll do. Ah, 
Ah, God damn it, the berry bushes hurt you. God damn berry bushes hurting me. I guess you could kill those fish down there for some for some food as well if you wanted to. Not strictly necessary, but it's something you can do. Okay, this has been blocked off now. Is there another way around here? I thought there was. Oh, there it is, yeah. Just looking for a little bit more loot if we can find it. There's some more essence over there. There's another berry bush here as well. We got loot and scoot. This is the speed boost. Oh my god, that speed boost is amazing. There's some more essence there. Some gold there as well. Okay, we're in a good spot right now. Ember Seeker as well. Some more embers around the area. That's plus four. I don't know if they all four drop in the same spot or what. But this is about where we need to be going. I was just about to say there'll be a Ravager down here though. Can he get through here? I don't know if he can. Looking like he maybe can. <laughs> Okay, so I'm pretty sure our actual loot is down there, which is problematic for us, obviously. Can't get through there. Unfortunately, we've taken quite a long time thus far. There's some more of that. We've been taking quite a long time so far, so things are going to get more difficult soon. More gold there. I'd like one more gold to get a crown. That'd be nice. Like I said, it's good to sort of revisit areas you've already been to to look for extra loot that may have spawned. I guess our ravagers have got to be in here. Ooh, that guy is on my tail. I'm a bit stuck here, to be honest. I'm a bit stuck. I'm going to need to sort of maneuver those Ravagers into better positions, otherwise I'm going to be kind of screwed. Want to come over here? So it annoys me that they can get over that gap so easily. <laughs> right. Zoom straight past him here. There's going to be other Ravagers around here, so I've got to be ready for that. There's a key as well, not that we need it, but thank you. Okay. Ravager down there. God, I'd be near our treasure soon. More berries over there. I don't need the berries right now, but I'll go grab them. Just good to have more. I think we're pretty close to our treasure now. There's treasure up there, look. Oh, it's right here. There we got it. Right. Now we got to escape, which isn't particularly easy because of the guy, the Ravager that's near the door. That guy's going to make things mighty difficult. There is other ways out. But ah bugger. Okay, let's let's try and get him to come down here. This is actually I, I think I've burned myself here because there's a guy down here on that door. There is another staircase over here. I'm gonna have to run for it. Okay. Made it out of that hazard. I'm not gonna jump over the water because I always get killed doing that. And there is a Ravenger over here near spawn, remember. We did see one near spawn. More essence there. We've got eight, lovely. So we don't want to run directly into him if we can help it. It would also be nice to find an extra coin if we can, just to get up to four to get a crown, but... I don't know how plausible that's going to be. Yeah, I hear him. There he is, look. All the way around here. 
Okay, we've made it. Lovely stuff. Well, that was a pretty good escape. Nice one. That was a pretty good escape. Okay, so no essence fell this time. We got a good bit of stuff there as well, lovely. And we'll see how much and how much loot that ends up giving us. Take the path of the coward. <laughs> I wonder why you'd escape without one. What's the point in just not dying? I don't know. Anyways, this is a, this is a good first run. Made it out. I'm up to 28, lovely. Okay, so let's take a look at our terms. Three for 27. That that seems like a very very good idea. But at the same time, we do want to take a look at what's on offer. I think we should go for three of these. And get three terms right off the bat. Good, good. Okay. Now we put those in there, which won't do anything for us. And we reset our run and go back. Now, apparently I don't need to sleep to reset it. That's just been a bug in the past that it hasn't reset for me. Are you, you okay? Can I get to that door? I wonder if I can. There you go. That's a, that's a pretty good run. We have started in here this time, um, which... I'm not sure if it's, if it's the point. Reset your spawn point after leaving. So how do I get out of here? There's our victory terms, lovely. We can put those in there. I thought I needed to use my frozen shards to get in here. I'm confused. Anyways, I'll expend a frozen shard so I know how many runs I've got left. I should be going down to 12 runs. I've got two more here. Wait, have I, already, have I already done two? That was my first one, right? I don't remember. That was my first one, I think. Was it? I don't know. What's going on? How do I escape? <laughs> Okay, I can, I, okay, I can escape like that. Whoa, 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 what the hell's this? Um, I don't think I was meant to take this. Oops. I think I just took... <laughs> okay, it's just that. I see. Right. Break that. What, what are you doing here? You can go back in there. Right, so I can get out there nice and easy. Okay. I see, I see. Okay, so we are supposed to then use this. So if we come up back over here, I want to make sure that I'm using these to get in. So I then come over here, put all of those in there, grab one. Okay, it's doing the animation. It's doing the right thing. <laughs> I want this bed here, don't I? To respawn there instead. We're good to go, right. So everything's reset, everything's good. I do want to put this in here. My victory terms and my crowns can go over there. My chest is all good right now. Make sure to... Oh, I didn't want to do that. You... Bastard. Okay. We put that in there and we go for our next run. Okay. So we are still on medium difficulty. That was a, a very good one. I mean, three terms in one run is pretty goddamn good. Um, I don't know how other people are doing at the moment, but I'm hoping three terms has puts me in a decent spot to start with. I, I very highly doubt that I'll win, but I'm hoping to place top five. That, that would be my goal. If I can play as top five, I'd feel pretty good. We've got level one artifact again here, so that's pretty lucky. 
We will eventually have to go down to the second second stage, but I'm I'm just not ready for it yet. Telling us to go this way. Okay, so I I, I think I know the general area there, so we still want to go this way here because this is where the, the early berries are. I like the, the early berries. Ember Seeker right off the bat as well. We got some gold here right off the bat too. That's nice. Bit of treasure early is pretty lovely. Uh, let's go back up this way and around this way, I think. We don't need a key this time. This is all about looking for loot. Grab some berries while we're here. Right, do we have any enemies in here first things first? No, we don't. That's great to see. Jump across there, lovely. And then any bad boys in here? Okay, I see one guy over the other side of there. I don't think he currently sees me. Can I sneak to get around him? Oh, there's two of them. Shit. Okay, well, maybe we'll take the long way around then. <laughs> maybe. Oh, they've blocked off that exit. God damn it, no. Oh, I made it, thank God. This is another thing, so, like, I was saying about, like, things not resetting. That hazard block there, I don't know if that's meant to reset or not, if it's random. I'm really not sure, I'll be honest. It's, it's, it's slightly confusing. My game might be a little bit bugged, which is making things harder for me, but easier in some respects, harder than others. Mostly harder. <laughs> Keep going, though. We only found one gold so far, so it's nothing crazy yet. Grab some more berries, thank you. The shame bats can't give you, like, meat or something. That'd be useful. Right, what are we looking like in here? There's a chamber. The chamber has a Ravager in it too, lovely. And it's only got one door to exit, which is great. But we're a bit trapped for uh, ways to go at the moment. Ideal. Ideal, people. This puts us in a real good spot now. It very much doesn't... Oh, we got ourselves a key here. And we also had a key spawn over here. I need to be running towards those chimes. Because uh, that's where stuff is spawning. And that happens throughout the, uh, throughout the run, so... There's plenty of stuff to grab. And I'm sure there's probably secrets and stuff around in various areas that I've not sort of thought about. See, there's some gold there. Look, lovely. Right. We can kind of check this area out again. The only thing is, normally when a Ravager, like, makes its way into an area, it then sort of refuses to leave. Take a little look around here. There is still, as I should have said, there's still a possibility of a Ravager around here. Some gold there. I'll grab that real quick. I knew he was on his way. Ah, bugger. Yeah, so we're pretty, we're pretty trapped right now. God. We're pretty trapped right now. I wonder if there's another way around over here. It's like a little shortcut through this bit, maybe. No. Because this guy on here is making things tough for us. That Ravager up there is not too bad. It's this one over here is the problem. Maybe we can coax him into this room. Actually, I shouldn't be doing that because... Getting over this water is a constant stopping point for me. Okay, we have managed to actually get him to follow us quite a ways here, which is pretty good. Also some gold there, lovely. We're up to four gold now at least, that's something. Some more gold here. We've been in this area for way too long at this point, so I'm a bit worried. 
trying to head back this way and see if we can maybe get around the other guy. Another key there. Apparently there is just a chance that there's loads of keys. Like, that's just a thing. Oh, dude, he's literally sat on the door. What the hell am I meant to do about that? So I'm kind of stuck between a rock and a hard place right now. I've got very little way of getting towards my, um... Got loot and scoot, lovely. He's right there. Nope, I'm dead. Damn it, the water! The fucking... Oh, I really can't. Fucking cheeses me off so much, man. That was a horrible, horrible one. But I have, I have kind of asked people, and they've basically said that that can happen sometimes. Sometimes you have a run, and the Ravagers are just in positions where you are absolutely screwed, and you, you, you're never going to win. That, that can just happen. Which I, I think is a little, a little annoying. I don't think that should happen, really. I think if you're smart enough, you should be able to get around it. But I feel like then I just, unless I waited a really, really long time, I just didn't really have a choice. But. We'll go for another run and see if we can make it work. I, I was hoping Loot and Scoot would make it a lot easier to jump over the gap, but Soul Sand just saps all of your momentum. And also you saw that little bridge closed as well. The little metal uh, trapdoor bridge. Right. We got level 1 artifact again. No level 2s thus far. My berry bush respawned. It has. Good. Where am I going? I, I think I've just got to try and be quicker about things. I'm taking too long. No Ravager in this room makes things a lot easier. Yeah, basically I've got to jump on these little, these little prongs. And then jump over using said prongs. But I find that very difficult. <laughs> I am not good at it. There's a Ravager right, I didn't see you, dick. If I die again here, I'm going to be annoyed. Just bugger off, mate. <laughs> Why you always got to be in the worst positions possible? You did see as well, by the way, that my loot was in the water where I died there. Basically, I'm just going to avoid that if that happens, because that's not meant to happen. I don't know why it's not respawning. Gold there, lovely. A little bit more gold there. Finding a lot of golden nuggets here. This room's empty at the moment. Is this room empty? Because this room rarely is. Okay. Loot and scoot is lovely. Oh, why? Why, why, why? In the worst positions, also my FOV. Makes things confusing. I'm gonna run into another Ravager over here, aren't I? Gold. Berry bush. Loot and scoot is useful. Just for being able to get away pretty quick if we see one of those boys. Compass is leading us around this way somewhere. I'm a bit confused though, because I didn't think there was any more way I could go that way. Unless there's like a room over here somewhere. No, I, I genuinely don't know where else I could be going here. This has confused me. 
I do like the fact that we've got this little hidden door here. But yeah, it says I'm, I'm right here, but... I'm not. There must be another room, like, entrance over there somewhere, but I don't know where that is. I don't know how to get over there. Lovely few embers there. Key. Yeah, I, I, do, I don't know how to get there. But potentially, like, up here some Why is there a random terracotta block there? It's a bit strange. I don't actually know if there's anything sort of up in these areas. I, I think I'm pretty lost right now, I'll be honest. Another key there, but more gold. I don't know how to get to this. It, it must be upstairs. It's got to be upstairs. But I'm pretty sure there's a Ravager, like, right here, isn't there? There's two right here. Are you coming for me? Yes, you are. Could you sprint, please? Could you sprint, please? Oh, my God. Okay, so this is yet another stalemate kind of situation here. Because those dudes ain't going to move. My heartbeat is getting very fast now, which is bad. Yeah, those dudes ain't really going to move, but I need to get to the upstairs of that building to get my loot, I'm pretty sure. I don't even know for a fact, I'm just, I think. Yeah, there's the little ghosty boys. Dude, this is insane. They're everywhere. They're actually everywhere. There's one in here too. This is this is madness. This is actually madness. This is blocked off too. I'm so I'm so fucked. Mate, this is what what's a man to fucking do? I just dropped a key in there and it didn't fucking open. I dropped a key in and it didn't open. What the Oh my God, I was just going to go and hide out in that room. What happened to my key? I dropped a key in the hole and it didn't open. Oh man, this game's frustrating. This game's frustrating as all hell. Right, last run. Not, not particularly enthused about how this is going to go, to be honest. I, the placements of the Ravagers just seem to be absolutely screwing me. Like, an ins an insane amount of being screwed. I thought this was going to be like, I wouldn't say easy, but I thought I was going to be able to get like a good few turns an episode. I mean, I've got three so far, which isn't bad, but one good run and then three just absolutely terrible ones is uh, it's not a good track record. The, the worst part about that last one is I got so much gold. So much gold. I should have just left with all the gold. Yeah, let's, let's keep it going and see what we can get. This will be a level 2, won't it? No, level 1 again. Level 1 again. Right. I'm hoping it's not like in a very back corner sometime, some, somewhere this time, because that's what screwed us there. It was just in a position where all the Ravagers wanted to be. I don't know if there's actually some sort of logic to that in terms of where the Ravagers position themselves, if it's actually near the artifact or if it is just completely random. But it does seem to be that they like to congregate around where my artifact is. Really, really do not like this whole jumping over the goddamn water thing. It's really messing me up. Uh, 
I was maybe looking in here. Doesn't look like we're looking in the castle this time. That better not be a Ravager I just heard. I think it was. I think I'm stuck. Let me grab this. Get the hell out of here. I don't know, like... How, so, this the, the hazard block and my clang block thing, they don't seem to, like, move or change even when the difficulty gets higher from what I've been able to see, which is confusing, because I thought that's what the, what the whole point of them was. Uh, one second. Okay, we are back. Ugh, right. Where were we? Where were we? We're on our last run. I don't exactly know where we're going at this point here. Hal, I do like this. There's a little secret there. I don't know if there's ever going to be anything in that secret, mind you, but it's cool that it exists. Alright, we've got some berries. We're good to go. And we need to try and find our last thingy here. There isn't a Ravager in here, so that probably means there's quite a few in this area. Yeah, there's one there, look. I really don't like this area of the map. The area of the map freaks me out. Let's try and take the scenic route again. Did, I, did we already go this way? I can't remember. I shouldn't really be running, but I want to because <laughs> it's faster. There's a key. Uh, oh, what the hell? There was a key, but it kind of disappeared. I don't exactly know what happened there. God damn it. It's, yeah, he's right there. I forgot about that. What am I supposed to do with that? What am I supposed to do when he's right there? There's always one in that room. I really wish that room was like... Because it's like the exit room to the next area. I kind of wish it was like a protected area. But yeah, yet again, I think we're going to have a position where... Uh, our next, um, our next collectible is just too difficult to get to. I mean, oh, that just shot off right as I went by it. Like I got, I've got to remember that. That could be, that could be really problematic. I mean, just getting across this is a pain. I wish there was a little block to hop along. He's right there. Like, it's literally exactly where I need to go. Um, maybe I can try and go through the icy bit. Look for loot around here. Go up through here, potentially. Got another soul shard thing here. Okay, we are we are here. Lovely stuff. Okay, back exactly the way we came. Especially now he's there. I did not see him. <laughs> right, exactly the way we came. Not going to bother about other loot. If I find it on the way back, that's fine. Otherwise, I'm just going to try and make it back alive. No, 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 no. Okay, I made it. Oh, ho, ho. Every time that jump freaks me the hell out. Quickly loot around here. Yep, there's a few extra bits and bobs around. Sadly, still no extra penny. Like, I'm literally one gold off another crown every time. Every time, man, one gold off. But I'm going to just take my win and go. I'm not going to worry about it. Nothing extra dropped. Okay. Okay, we're not going to get 27 again, so we're not going to have enough to buy more runes, um, t terms, sorry, but we can buy some cards at least, maybe. Okay. 24. We could buy two. get up to five, which isn't a bad idea, but I think we ought to be buying cards, really. Of 
quick step sounds good. Okay, there's not much we can buy here, unfortunately. I think I'm just going to buy more terms, you know. I think terms are pretty valuable. Uh, except, can I not buy more than one? Maybe I can't. Okay, so what shall I get with my remaining 12? Guess I'll just gra grab that. Okay. Unfortunately, no more crowns for us. Hello. Right. So, we have a few terms now. When are these ethereal cards going to show up? I want to buy some of these ethereal cards, but I don't know how to. Because <laughs> there's none of them there. Maybe I have to restock the shop with this? I don't know. Either way. Either way. What's all this about? Anyways, I think we're going to leave it there for now. Um, we didn't do too well this episode, but we did gain some terms, which I think is not bad. I think we've got four. We've either got four or five now. I think we've got four. Um, either way. Not, not too bad. And we'll continue on the next episode and hopefully do a little bit better. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one.